Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm back with another Fate Grand Order video. What are we going to do today? Well, I realized something a little while ago. That there's actually something that I've been meaning to do for a while now. Um, that I haven't been doing. So I'm going to be doing that, and that's going to be today's video. Because I'm going to be trying to do something that I've been trying to do since he came out, basically. I am going to attempt, with my full friend points here... To get my boy Anger to Manu. He is a zero star servant in here. So get ready. This is going to be a long ass video. So if you're going to be here, I'm going to be skipping a lot of this as well. Thank you very much for watching if you choose to do so. If you've pulled him, tell me how you've pulled him. I've seen some people who have an MP5 and I'm like, how? I've been able to. I have an MP5 uh, SSR servant. I do not have Anger to at all. I do not have a single copy. It's not like I haven't been trying. I have been trying legitimately <laughs> since he came out, pulling on the friend banner whenever I can. Now, thankfully, I don't think there's anything that's... I have to wait too long for the friend banner, so I'm just gonna start doing this now. I'm gonna burn through a lot of these and hope to some force of goodwill that I get him. So yeah, that's gonna be today's video. Sit back and relax. So, how you guys been? I've been doing pretty all right. I've been busy with work. That's basically it, though. Uh, I haven't really had time to start this new event. I have to. I was originally planning. I was planning to do. I have so much stuff that I'm, like I plan to do. Ooh, thank you for the three star for the for videos and stuff. And then just when it comes time to it, I'm just like too tired from anything. Turns out being a supervisor is uh, tough work and constantly got you on edge for anything. It's okay. It means more money, and that means I can potentially do more stuff down the line uh, with that money as well. And it gives me a good, f easy frame of mind as well. Ay, ay, ay. But yeah, I probably, you know, after I do this, I'm gonna actually start. I'm gonna have so much <laughs> of the bronze. I'll be able to grind up the bronze uh, stuff at least pretty easily. So that's good for me. Hmm. Let's go through here. We get plenty of foe. I don't know what I'm going to do with these foe, either. Don't know what I'm going to do with a vast majority of it, besides just... Get some mana prisms out of it. I really wish that... I can't remember if they did it on the JP version. I should have added this to the survey, but they really need to include, like, a... Summon times 100 on this thing. <coughs> because I have no idea why it's still just at 10. It seems... Dumb. To put it this low. I don't fully understand the reasoning behind it. Uh, other than I guess they want you to suffer? That's all. That's possible. It is Fago. Fago does take plenty of... Like most things, I assume it's actually related to like the monkey scratch code that they have in the game. That they actually don't know how to do it and they have to like figure out how to do it. And it's an entire process. Yeah. I know that the, the code for Fago is not actively the best actively the worst it's a miracle that go made it as long as it did considering it was held together by some duct tape and an actual duck that they found on a parking lot that's what they used to keep the servers running so we had so many server issues in especially in the jp version of the game oh my god so many crazy server issues we have them less here like maintenance is typically four hours we haven't had a string of like like long janta in a very long time which is a shame, because it was always really fun nights where everyone would sit down and be like, Is the game broken? Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> so sit down by a fireside, get some sink course, and just kind of sit back and relax. You know, I kind of miss a little bit of that stuff. I mean, the game should improve over time, and obviously some of the no game should really have gone into maintenance as much as Fago did after maintenance. There was like maintenance, and then there was maintenance, maintenance that came right afterwards. Uh, so it didn't really make sense for a, for a game that makes this much money to have that many server problems. But they don't have them as much anymore. I think they still get it, obviously, when a hype new unit comes out and everything dies. But that's to be expected for the most part. Even Dokkan dies during hype units, even though we haven't had one of those in a very long time. Some people would argue with me and say, like, that's not true. We just had Goku. And I would say, 
Yeah, I guess you're right. Cooler was cool, though. That's Dokkan. It's a different thing. It's actually very interesting to think about the, the differences of someone. Not to compare and contrast, because whatever, you play what you play and you enjoy what you enjoy. Um, but it is funny to see the differences of, like, Dokkan stretching to find, like, I don't know, Goku, Kid Goku, and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Put them together. Yeah. Morphago just simply just makes new characters. <laughs> and that's good enough. And then depending on the design people you were go hype for, they don't. Or maybe it's just a slight different variation. Like, you can't do Alter Goku. Well, there is already an Alter Goku. That's just Goku Black. But you see, I get what I'm saying here. You can't just have him in a different class and be like, this is Goku with the properties of if he could have a sick writing machine or something. Not really something you can do in that kind of game. But you can in Fago. And that kind of benefits it, I think, in the long run. At least in terms of characters. Because obviously when they explode, it's like... <laughs> there's no explosion when it comes to Goku. Goku's already a mainstay icon. He's on the Thanksgiving Day parade. He sells himself. But Fago sells their characters from the start. Ooh, loading. I've started to think that the Fago loading means nothing. Because <laughs> it never gives me anything when it comes to free-to-play banners. I always assumed that it meant something in um, actual summon-wise. But, you know, I haven't actually had it mean anything for me in a very long time. Always thought it meant something like, oh, this is guaranteed something new because it's loading up the animations and stuff. But no, it's not. It's just doing it. Just for the funds of it. There we go. Let's continue in here. Do I have to sell stuff soon? No, I don't. It doesn't look like it. Uh, I'm pretty close to having to sell. <laughs> in servant-wise, at least. Oh, and craft essence, too. We're going to get there pretty soon. We'll see which one gets there first. But yeah, I think it's interesting. Uh, the differences in them. And obviously some other... I guess it's different because, technically speaking, Dokkan is, like, never moving... I get, in order for... I mean, there's the manga. But in order for Dragon Ball to move forward, it needs an anime. It, it, the manga ain't going to be doing it, especially if it's not written actually by... Toriyama and it's made by another guy who may get supervision from Toriyama is from what I understand but it's not the same as actually having the guy write it or something yeah but in general there's no moving forward but guy Tenki Aichi though that's coming back it's gonna be pretty sick the fact that some people in Dokkan land have to say and look at be like, oh man, new Budokai Tenkaichi, this could only mean new units for us and it's like no <laughs> I don't think you understand what that means. <laughs> I think it means Dokkan might accidentally get new units, but it's not anything related to them. We didn't get anything for Kakarot. That was Legends. Dragon Ball Legends might get something, but not Dokkan. Dokkan is just like in its own weird island bubble where it just makes up kajillion fucking money and is able to do whatever it wants. Similar to Fago, it makes kajillion money. Not as much, well, it still makes plenty of money, but it makes it in, like, weird bursts now. Where they'll release one hype character, and then that's enough to sell off for the entire year. At least that's what it looks like for me based off of the charts and stuff. I could be completely talking out of my own ass, which is possible. I am just here to sit back and try and get angry. We've already gone a million in. <laughs> no sign of him. It is really interesting to think of, like... Because it's not even that he's, like, good. If you're here saying, like, do you want him because he's good? No. Not really. It's just kind of because I want him. It, it annoys me that out of all the units that I've gotten, through all my lucky summons, all the five-star that I've pulled from just a single multi, and sometimes occasionally two in one multi, I've never been able to get Angra once. It actively infuriates me to think of the unit. And I really like having all the uh, three and under, except for one, Columbus. I don't I don't believe in getting Columbus, so I don't ever plan to get Columbus. But I like having all the ones in below, just in my collection, for collection purposes. And it, it actively annoys me that I can't have them, and there's no real good way for me to get them. Because <laughs> he's only exists in this banner, and he's extremely difficult to actually pull, as you can tell from the almost a million I've spent trying to get him. Oh man, I can't believe some people have him MP5. That's the crazier thing to me. How crazy is your luck that you can get him to MP5? That's insane to me. Hello, Ardush. 
easier to look at us at least. I'll also be able to get a whole bunch of medals from this as well. It's a shame that I'm not like they remembered the medals for the four and five stars, but the th three and below, I think they didn't remember it. So I have to actually collect them all again, which is annoying because Marish is level 90 and he should be much higher than what he is currently. It'd be a smart idea for me to slap on that uh, third bonus of him ability, but I need a little bit more medals from him before I can actually do that. Yeah, it seems like I, I felt, you know, it, it didn't, I didn't take it as that. They didn't mean it as that, I mean, but I took it as like a slight against me. It's like, okay, you pulled a whole bunch on these free, free to play banners. We are not taking any of that into account. <laughs> You'll have to get them all again. It's like, I already did that once, and it's really annoying to summon on this. Couldn't you just remember through all of history all my free-to-play summons? No. Shame. Real shame. As we continue on deep. Doop, doop, doop. Here we go. I'm also getting a lot of EXP, which is nice. I don't really have any... All my units are basically already at max on Ascension level. So, I already also got some in storage for the next unit that I hopefully get. I actually realized I haven't gotten a single new unit this year at all. To be fair, I haven't really been going for them like crazy. Um, but yeah, uh, when I was looking at the Valentine base, I was like, how many did I get past New Year's? And the answer is I didn't get any. No, actually, there's one. Kagekiyo. Mushi. Not Mushi Altar. Uh, uh, Ushiwaka Maru Alter. I did get her. So there's one. But for the most part, that's it. <laughs> one in three months. <laughs> no four star, nothing else. Well, to be fair, there's not like anything that I really wanted that except for uh, Ushiwaka Maru. That's basically it. Oh, and I guess the Tango Master as well. That's technically two. But still, I don't know. I don't, I don't count free to play as getting. Because everyone gets those unless they're really lazy and don't do the event or something. So, you know, I just feel like... I don't know. It was weird to look at them and like, I didn't actually get that many servants. Or it didn't feel like I had gotten that many servants last year. In terms of new ones. But maybe at this point is when they started just releasing less of them. I don't know. Actually, I've never taken into account, are they releasing more servants or less servants over time? It actually kind of feels like less. Which feels weird. Which, which is, I guess, good because you want to actually have more reruns. So you can get some of the limited ones. And Fago is a really weird gotcha. In that they buff old characters and they also and buff their animations. Like, it's not weird that they buff old characters because there's plenty of gotchas that buff old characters. Like, for example, Dokkan is one of them. But in terms of updating the animations, not a lot of people actually do that. <laughs> their idea of updating the animations is... How about you just have a brand new unit who is also this person and then you can just pay us and that would be great? And Fago's answer to that is like, well... We can have that. We can have both, really. So there you go. And I think it's because they realize that a lot of people actually really like the servants that they have. So, you know, they'll throw them a bone occasionally. Plus, a lot of those early servants, like Amato over here, when they released, were just terrible animations. Oh, my God. I don't know if anyone remembers how bad some of the older animations were, but they were bad. They're bad. Caster orbs. Every single caster just shot orbs out of their fist or whatever. It was not good. And I think some of them still have that, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, they've been working towards fixing that. You know, probably not at the pace that I would like. I think, yeah, I think now I have to start selling. No, I don't. Okay, sweet. I was like, okay, I went over the top. But I guess we'll keep on rolling, baby. Keep on going. I'm not going to be able to do any quests until I actually get all this out of my goddamn inventory, but it's fine. Ah, there we go. Man, I'm gonna have a lot, a lot of some of this stuff in here. I'm also afraid that the the, the phone will just, cr <laughs> this screen will just crash, based on how much I'm just clicking on this summon screen over and over and over again. Eventually, something's got to give. Man, still nothing. We're almost two million deep. Again, like I said, the rates of him are harder than an SSR. I want to say. By this point, I would have already gotten the S. I've actually gotten more of 
um, Saber Lily that I've got in Avangar Manu, which really pisses me off because I already have her NP5. I think I think I've pulled two of her, and I think they have this, a similar rate. Stupid. So stupid that it goes like that. Ah, uh, but whatever. You know, certain point you just gotta live with it. I also have never burned those because I'm afraid of bad luck, like, cultivating all my summons. If I burn something as rare as that, <laughs> they'll know. And then that'll spell bad news for the future of my account, that's for sure. More summons! Mmm. Uh, there we go. Thank you, Brock. Go in here. We got man, I got a lot of the. I'm gonna be. I'm set in stone for all the bronze currency in the new event. I can tell you that much. I have basically all of them max and limit broken. I think at this point, I've pulled so many of them. Hmm. <laughs> Mendicardo, thank you. There was actually a really long bit there where I, he was like, NP "Oh man, really." All right, time to sell. They really should release more of this. I don't need any of these guys because I already have them all MP5. So they can go away. I wish there was more use to them besides mana prisms, but it is what it is. Do, do, oh God, I pulled a lot of servants. Okay, go up to here. Whoop. Lost it there. Well, I'll pause for real quick. Okay, back to working. So back I go. Make sure I don't accidentally click summon on the wrong thing. There we go. All right, back at it again. Mm, I really wish the Fago was available in other things, so I didn't always have to break out the Elgato if I wanted to record stuff on it. The Elgato is nice and all, but it is a pain in the ass sometimes because it seems like sometimes it just doesn't work. Just for fun. They just decide to say, hey, you know what? I'm just not going to work. And I also got very limited space into where I can actually put the Elgato and make it all. It's always a mess whenever I break this thing out. <laughs> um, which makes it very hard for me to actually just, like, record the video stuff that I need for the day. I just wish that the Go was available on other devices, like a PC type of stuff. That would make it so much easier for me. Yeah, I know there's ways to put it on there, but it's not the same. Like, if it was on Steam, obviously, that'd be great. Like, Marvel Snap, that makes it much easier. But, nope, don't exist that way at the moment. Shame. I did hear that they're doing something with Google Play that might make it so that you can have, like, play Google Play things on a PC, which would be cool to have eventually. Uh... I don't know, Fago's bar barely, like, functions on a phone sometimes. <laughs> so I'm not sure if it would be able to even support any stuff that you can do on PC just yet. But, you know, still, it'd be cool to have. Doop doop, as we go, continue to go through here. Ah, <sighs> please, just a single copy of Angra. That's all I'm really asking for here. I don't think it's too much to ask after how for how many years I've been playing the game. It's ridiculous to think of any character that you just don't have. The, like, there's a white whale. Like, I've never th heard of a unit so old that's been in the game for many, many years. It's just, like, it's so impossible to get. But it's also just so bad that it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's really weird. It's maybe one of the weirdest things out there. I'm trying to think of... There's not many out there. I think a good example is, you know, just because obviously I have Dokkan on the brain a lot. Um, Dokkan has the One Piece um, collab units, and obviously Aureli is another one. But the One Piece was a free-to-play character that was By Guys Goku, and they have never had another By Guys Goku since that collaboration. Which sucks, because it's a great moment, and he was like an SR on JP. I think he was an SSR in, on the Global Fire version of the game. But, you know, that's that's dumb. He should never have been. <laughs> if they had known, like, hey, 
This is a pretty iconic moment. Is it okay to just throw it away on a One Piece like event? Yeah, it should be fine. Who cares? It's like, no, you should care just a little bit more before you do something that reckless. What if there's a situation where you might one day want to sell that Goku to someone? It's like, a oh, sell this version of Goku, please. That'd be insane. And then that day came, and then they weren't prepared for it. And now no one has Bai Guy Goku. Unless I guess you count the Super Saiyan Gohan and Goku, but I don't count it as Bai Guys because I don't think he does the Bai Guys animation in it, so it's not the same. I actually don't know if they do it. There's just so many dudes in Dokkan that I've actually lost count of what sort of ones do versus what they don't. Very forgettable. Similar sometimes to some certain Zomfago units, actually, where I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot that you exist. This is something that you do, just because I don't see you very often. Like I did with Kualter, where I was like, I don't know, people don't use him as much as they did in the day. I assume he's bad now, and the answer was no, he's actually still very good and very usable. Little did I know. Little did I know. Oh man, we're almost three million deep. Still no anger. Ah, maximum sadness. Maximum sad. Ooh. Nothing. God. I gotta just stop thinking that the foe means anything. It doesn't mean anything. All it means is pain and suffering. That's what the foe means. Also, isn't that an old Valentine? Uh, not old Valentine's Day? I'm getting, I'm getting so far back, I'm getting, like, old. Yeah, yeah, isn't that from... Oh, don't do this to me now. Come on. Come on. Oh, one moment. Pause again. Well, I'm annoyed that it's still like this, so I'm just gonna end the video right here and maybe try again at a, at a later session. <laughs> just because I realize the video is almost 22 minutes long. So no Angra in this time, you know, if you pulled Angra while watching this video, feel free to tell me. Maybe this is a good time. If you want to use your free-to-play serve, uh, if you want to start just wasting them with me, just start throwing them in here and see if you can also get Angra while I'm doing this, feel free to tell me. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Gotta fix this stupid piece of shit Elgato thing. Anyway, till next time, bye.